Go for one on the thing, maybe. How fucking stupid this loop is, mate. Yep, there's the pallet. Reassurance, so he's just safe on the hook. This is actually getting to the point of dumb game design, I have to say. There's nothing I can actually do. This loop again. Tiny man, this dungeon is just designed by survivor mains. It's literally just pallet, 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 safe window. Slowly starting to wait this map, I have to say. It's way too safe down here. Based on games I've been having. I actually forgot to take no head off for this one. It's fine. Yeah, I was going to say, I guess we don't have room because we put it right next to a gen as always. Locked out of animation there, so we'll stick a penny on. So that's that, I think. Yeah. There goes Penny again. Game had to think on whether that was legal. Fucking space dude, I was pressing control. Ranger. Life. 
I mean, she's going to get that. Consistently landing bottles. Need to watch for this uh, flashlight safe. I'm going to pick Fang up. I don't think I can actually hook this guy. And I'm mad. I actually couldn't though. Because again, map design. I don't know where Feng is now though, so I think we just lose. Reassurance. need this guy. Still doesn't mean anything. Yes. I'm gonna stick this on here Still finding penalties by the way, so we just replace that with one again. This build's problematic to play against apparently. Yet to see that.
fucking hell, dude. Yeah, game's over. Nerf gen defense. Go for one on the thing, maybe. Fucking stupid this loop is, mate. Yep, there's the pallet. Reassurance, so he's just safe on the hook. This is actually getting to the point of dumb game design, I have to say. There's nothing I can actually do. This is just safe, there's no mind going to it. <laughs> yep, there's the last gem. I'm nowhere it's gonna help. That's not nowhere. No, it's down on the ground, which is quite good. Tells him where it is, though, so. goes because it's highlighted to him. There's the save. Can make that before I can slow him down. This is with no ed, very problematic perk. doesn't actually do anything. <laughs> Fucking funny dude. Where's the save? <laughs> Gonna do this shit again? I fucking hate this map guys. I really do. It's so badly designed. Yeah, now he makes it because I can't actually catch up to him. Got no bottles. Probably got hope as well, maybe. Dead hard anyway, so it wouldn't have mattered. Fucking shit map, it really is. I'm actually considering just burning like Macmillan's or something like that. Because I'm getting fucking sick of playing on this just 
shit-heap, quite honestly. Yeah, he had hope anyway, so there was no chance I was actually going to catch him. Two of them did. It's literally speed axe at end game, but there you go. And the power roll, apparently. See you on the next one. I think this is the first clown game on the new map, actually. Dink. Everybody knows who I am. Okay. Uh, I saw that foot. Sorry, under the uh, whatever the foot that is, carriage. Mm -hmm, that's too long. Did see that bird. There. Wow. A uh, purple flashlight has to be. Like we need to tunnel again. Very strange how people say you don't need to tunnel in this game to win as killer, but every time I don't tunnel in the games, I lose them. So, don't know about that one. basically a fucking infinite. Let's just give them all walls they can see over. Who fucking needs brains to play the game anymore? Take me back to 2016, mate, where you actually had to put effort in for this game.
Infinite. Let's take an offensive DS that Behaviour said for several months that they're going to remove. Yep, there you go. The survivor perk, innit? Of course they're not going to remove it. Of course that doesn't hit. Okay, sure. Right, and it magnetizes me into it. Physically impossible to defend these gens. Is that? Yeah. The fuck's that about? Other girls still down here. That doesn't land? Okay. That's not gonna land because I aim it too low. This loop again. Tell you, man, this dungeon is just designed by survivor mains. It's literally just pallet, 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 safe window. Literally, everybody's here. First up, don't mean anything. Did see that. Same speed as me for some reason. I'm not going to run around shark that at the time. It's, it's impossible to defend these gens anyway. As I say, they can just do one in the basement. Steam cards feel off as well. Ha <laughs> ha! 
Put her in the basement because we lose the last gen. Can't defend it, they made it impossible. Yep, there you go. God forbid the killers have any sort of power. We're not going to have no idea either because it's right next to the shack and it fucking tells them where it is anyway. I know Jill was over there. Did we get one. Can't stand on that ledge. Why? There you go, we get one. I'm not even going to try and defend the gates. Impossible. This loop is just complete bullshit though anyway. I'm starting to see it. It's just fucking stupid. The way that they can run round here. They come through here, go through the window which gives them a massive fucking lead. Unless you want to vault. So they can come all the way round here, get down here. Another window that puts more distance between them. Then there's a pallet there. There's a pallet in here. Then they can go through the teleporter again. It's fucking dumb, mate. There's also that, but that does slow them down when they land, I think. I think that is a fall that can... Yeah, unless you've got balance, you get slowed there. You still have to come all the way around here. By the time you get down there, that's that's like full recovery. And there's a pallet right there anyway, just to save them from that. I do like the design of this room though. It's quite cool to have two layers like that. That's quite funny. You can only run it, you can't run that way either. Well you can do. Then you drop down. There's a 50 50 there. So they drop the pallet. They can either drop down and you can go across like that. Which is pretty much a free hit unless you have balance. They can land and probably put that down and stun you. Knowing behaviour though, they'll probably put an invisible wall there so you'd have to walk all the way around like that. At some point, probably. There you go. Trying to head on, I think, when he jumps in that locker. Again, the only survivor that ever needs DS is the one that got it off. Always happens to me. Without fail, this always happens. It's getting pretty fucking suspicious, to be honest. I don't really know. It's just, it's consistent, like, bad luck on my part. Because whatever survivor I decide to start tunneling, nobody else will have it. It is literally only the fucking survivor that I start to try and pick. Because initially I was going to go for, who was it? I think it was the Feng at the beginning. Whoever I got the first, the first hook on. I think it was the Feng. And then we switched to Claude because they had her at the hook at like two gens. And there it is. None of the others have it. Just this one Claude. It happens every fucking game. It doesn't matter what survivor I choose. 
it is always the survivor I need to try and get out as a 100% of the time. Never anybody else. There you go. Bit of a shit one. <laughs> 